Stickosaurus here, and today we are starting on another Flashman helmet. Oh my, it is Flashman Blue, Blue Flash. I don't know what their naming convention is, I can't remember. I wanted to do Blue Mask, but everyone kind of is like, hey, do Blue, do Blue Flash. I'm like, okay, I guess. And then like 30 people asked me if I had Flashman Blue. So I was like, uh, I guess I'm going to soon. So we started on this. Beautiful Mogwai 3 Command Center. He has all these. We have the visor printed. We have the gem printed. They'll probably cast this in resin. Vacuum form the visor. We should be good to go. I don't think we're going to do any of the goggle shut thing. But we could maybe. Maybe we could put magnets in here and you know, make it attachable. We'll see. We'll see how vacuum forms. Go to vacuum form table so we can do thicker plastic so it can hold its shape a lot better. So uh, it's a possibility. But we are gonna get some spot play on this because my sand is broken right now and I have like four helmets here that I wanna get started on and you're gonna obviously know what these are as the videos come out. But let's get to it. So mask, we're going to do black first, mask that, and then do the pink. And then we'll do the silver jaw, and we're going to figure out what we're going to do with the ears and stuff. I flash green to that same spot, and I haven't figured out what I'm doing yet, so hopefully i will figure it out by the time I get there. We're gonna somehow attach the visor. It's a pain. Magnus elastic, and then we'll get to the spinner round. finished looking snazzy i think this turned out super well painting everything i like the vinyl we used for the ears if you saw on green that was a mistake the vinyl i think makes it pop looks crisper better than i could have painted with how maybe how i finished them but also they're like modeled like into the helmet so like they're not like crisp triangles to begin with so it's a little odd but you know you can make it work the visor's a little funky on this side over here. And again, it's, there's nothing to really glue them to. Like, we had to glue right to the helmet here. And I think that we pulled it over a little bit more than we wanted it to. I don't really have an answer for that, truly. Uh, 
I think maybe if we heated this up, we could have bent it in a little more, but I didn't want to ruin it. Uh, it doesn't super, you know, it's not noticeable from right on. If I'm looking at it from the side here, I can kind of see in there a little bit, but, you know, I don't know. You know, six foot away, it looks great on the shelf. And that's what's mainly important to me. Make sure you get the good side when you're showing this off, as you'll see in the TikTok. <laughs> but uh, gem turned out well. I think our plan B with the vacuum forming and painting worked great. Fits in there really nice. Maybe a couple extra detail lines. I don't know if there's one around uh, the gem up here, but I like it. I think it works. I think it's nice. But yeah, that's another Flashman done. I really powered through these. Like they all just kind of came together like that all, all at once, except for red. Red took a little bit, but you know, that's a different story. Like I said, just the visors kind of let me down. I mean, vacuum form, I think the vacuum formed rather well. They just, without having like a fit in place with them on the front, it was really hard to get them glued in. Um, so it's probably like my only lackluster takeaway from most of these Flashman helmets, but I don't think they look bad. I just wish it was a little more secure. Like if you push this, it uh, gives a little, which I don't like, but again, perfectly fine for cosplay and anything. It's not like you're gonna be actually hitting with a sword or something in your face. So again, thanks for watching. As always, follow me on TikTok, Instagram, and Twitter at Stickasaurus, Facebook, Stickasaurus Cosplay with Props, Twitch, Stickasaurus Rex. Down in the description, you can find a link tree. There's a link to my Discord, as well as the Patreon. We're doing awesome community builds over there. We got $1 tier. You get exclusive videos and content, so check that out. And, of course, the merch store, if you're interested in some sick shirts. We got a lot of, like, inside joke shirts coming, too, as well. So look forward to that. But as always, I'm Stick Source, and I'll see you next time.